Hi everyone, welcome back. This is Nasim from nasimreza.com and today I am going to show you how you can connect your custom domain to your fourth wall web store. And this video could be technical for you, but don't worry if you need my help, then you can book a 30 minute personal consultancy with me. I will give this link on this video description and I will help you definitely. And in this field, I have more experience with that, but I will show you the step by step process i hope you will do that by yourself if you follow the my video instruction no more talks let's back to this topic this is the current domain that i have and i get it from fourth all and it's a subdomain and that's why it's free and here you can see in my website you can also support my channel okay by the way let's back uh, we just want to change the url okay because it's not looking professional so that's why on the settings and domain we can connect our domain our custom domain that that will provide our brand value and how we, you can give your own name that you already have so right now i don't have any new domain for connecting this uh, fourth wall web store so that's why i like i think i need to purchase a domain so this domain i just want to purchase which is uh, nasim official dot store and it's very cheap and i decided to purchase it because uh, for the tutorial purpose okay i just bought this under the two dollar and then when you have bought the name chip domain and for your help i will give the name chip on this video description so you can check this out so now let's copy this domain name and go back the dashboard and just we need to paste the domain name here and then hit connect and after that it will take 30 seconds but within 30 seconds it will take you on the next page and here you can see how you can connect to uh, your domain easily and this kind of all the record we need to paste on our website backend so this is the huge number so you don't need to make any mistakes so if you do manually okay but here is the option on automatic setup so if you want you can do that but i feel like i need to go with the manual one because i love manual one okay so just close this window and you can see now all the red signal so now we need to paste one by one all record in our domain section okay so in our advanced domain dns setting we found these two are automatically made here so just i need to delete that so let's delete these two and try to add the new one so first of all a record and i just want to keep the name and for your help i just want to do one by one so i quickly i am doing this for a video short length so it's basically seem just uh, say copy and paste okay and here you can see my all the uh, record are now ready and after that it will take few seconds and it will configure successfully and now you can see it's all are green now and when i get back then you can see it's synchronizing so that's when it will take some time actually and a few times later you can see my domain is completely ready and it's look now good and this is my own domain and it's not actually only set up my custom domain it's if i go on the store you can see it's also came here and when someone click from that link it will take open on my main domain like this so that's why it's pretty cool and i hope you can understand that's all for today if you found this video was useful then hit the thumbs up and if you want to see more video from me then consider subscribing to the channel because it will help me to continue working on this channel. My name is Nasim. I will see you on the next one. Till then, bye. Have a great day.